A lot of people are asking what the difference between modified sine wave and pure sine wave inverters are. Well, for one, you're going to see there's a significant difference in cost. Modified sine wave is always much less expensive. Uh, but the difference is modified uh, is not an exact replica of AC power, whereas a pure sine wave is an exact replica of what you get out of the wall socket at home. Uh, so an example of this, uh, tools like uh, a corded drill, when they have a variable speed, they often won't give you variable speed off of a modified sine wave, but as you can see, I'll show you with the pure sign, we can do slow to medium speed and high speed, all without having any issues. A modified sine wave would be all or nothing. Some other devices you might have issues with uh, modified sine as opposed to a true pure sine wave uh, would be uh, cordless tool chargers uh, are notorious for damaging the batteries in those cordless tools uh, because they don't understand the modified sign. So that's when you definitely use a pure sign. Uh, some other devices you might have issues with. Some high-end TVs might have lines on them. Stereos might have RF noise. Microwaves would generally take about twice the amount of time to cook if you're using modified sine wave, where if you use the pure sign, it's going to cook in the exact same amount of time it would if you're plugged in the RV park or whatnot and you're going to not draw as much power out of your batteries to 